Uh, Hannah is really good at that DJ sound. <laughs> Very impressed. There it is. <laughs> so I'm sure a lot of you all traveled to be here, meaning someone took you to an airport. Yeah. You ask someone to take you, and I think I figured out the perfect person to take everyone. It's someone that you like, but that you hate a little bit. <laughs> That's the only reason you would put someone through that. Idea. I have a roommate. Uh, the other day, she walked in with a toaster, which seems normal, uh, but we already had a perfectly fine working toaster. I asked her about this toaster. She said it cost $60. Which sounds crazy. Yes, correct. That is what I did. Uh, because toast to me is just uh, burnt bread. <laughs> and when I think of appliances that work better when you pay more for them, toaster is at the very bottom of that list. So I just don't know if she's having a different experience with her toast than I am. I have to make a mental note to ask her. Uh, I'm on Facebook. My parents are on Facebook, uh, specifically my mother. I can see everything she does. She can't do, see shit that I do. It works out well. Uh, the other day she changed her profile picture and I figured I'd check it out. It was the uh, Superman logo, but it was in pink and white. Uh, and at the bottom it said, Supermom. And I just stopped for a moment and thought, and I was just like, this seems cocky. <laughs> right? No? Seems yeah. yeah. seems seems very confident. She has a lot of confidence in her mothering skills. Uh, <laughs> the other day I got some really good news. Um, I kind of sold my first television show. That's the appropriate response. That's what I had banked on. <laughs> news to my friends and they said oh let's go to dinner I want to take you out for drinks let's have a little party and it was in that moment that I realized that those people aren't really my friends <laughs> because a real friend would have taken out their phone and sent a text message to my ex-girlfriend right away <laughs> Congratulations, they should have typed Britney sold the TV show, slash is getting mad pussy, bye! Uh, a lot of vegans here, a lot of vegans here. You can give it up for yourselves if you're vegan, I don't mind. Uh, the, thing about, the thing about vegans as a group is they constantly think people are trying to trick them. Uh, good and then they say something's not right here. Uh, there's a mystery. Which I mean if you want to live your life that way, go ahead. Uh, the other day my roommate came and knocked on my door and I don't know if you have this reaction but when someone knocks on my door unexpectedly, I behave as if I just murdered a hundred people. <laughs> I'm reading a book, the book flies across the door. She knocks on the door and she, uh, she has a pretty normal question. She says, you know, I'm going to the store if you want anything. Now, if you answer yes to that question, in my book, you're a monster. Okay? You should never say yes to that. That's never the right answer. People are being polite. Do not take advantage of that. And it made me realize that there are monsters amongst us all the time. And so I just, I jotted down a few other instances of humans just being monsters and I'm just going to read them for you. <laughs> if you're over the age of 18 and you think it's okay to go to a refrigerator, open it up, take out some milk, pour it in a glass and drink it like it's a regular beverage, you're the monster. <laughs> Don't wear that belt tight enough, 
so it's rendered useless. It's just an accessory. I don't know if you think it just looks cute. You're not using it right. You're a monster. You have one of those rolly suitcases, and I see you in the airport pulling the suitcase, but you're going too fast, so it's popping up off the ground every few minutes, and it looks like a baby bird that's trying to fly, but can't. You're a monster. Either pull it or pick it up. Make a decision. And last, but certainly not least, if you have a bottle opener and you go to a party, and someone comes up to you and they say, hey, can you open my bottle? And you're really bad at opening bottles, but so you do it anyway and it takes you two minutes to open that bottle? You're a monster. You're already a hero. You're ruining it. You're a hero with the bottle opener. Let them open the bottle. Right? I feel like that's been happening to me every day at A Camp since A Camp started. Oh, Tori. Tori's having a real moment. All right, you guys, that's my time. Thank you so much. Good, 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 good. Uh, to another amazing musical performer, Bujo! 